Hassan, given you're not a regulator, uh, but uh, I would like you to also add context around all the influx of venture capital for startups and technology companies that, are come, that has come in and what kind of impact has that made um, on, on the general uh, landscape in Pakistan? If I can just briefly first touch upon um, how practically this is all being tested uh, in terms of these updates and the regulations, I just want to give a little bit of context on beneficial ownership, yeah. if that's okay. So um, currently there is section 123A of the Companies Act in which uh, beneficial ownership information needs to be given. Um, SECP has uh, done an entire exercise whereby which they are asking all foreign uh, shareholders and directors to resubmit uh, the information dealing with this. Now today it's actually being tested because um, this particular provision and the notices issued by SECP have been challenged in the High Court and the High Court issued an injunction and it's being re-challenged in the Supreme Court. So what we're discussing in terms of the updates in this regulation, there's actually very pertinent practical testing of that, these particular provisions that are in line with the FATF recommendations which are being tested today. So that's just the context on, on the discussion thus far. You asked about the influx of VC funding. Um, there's been a lot of hype as regards, uh, there's been a lot of hype and a lot of funding as regards uh, opcos in Pakistan getting funding from overseas from their uh, offshore hold uh, One aspect of that is that when all these big valuations are thrown around, perhaps an enhanced exercise is not done with who is on the ground, whom the funding is being given to. Um, just to give you an example, recently there was a company um, that uh, got into a bit of an issue with the State Bank of Pakistan. Um, a sort of forged letterhead was given by one of the purported foreign investors and that resulted in the revocation of the license by the State Bank of Pakistan. So while there is good uh, regulations in terms of the EMI regulations, the PSP regulations, perhaps there needs to be a little bit more communication uh, at the time that this VC funding is given so that the operators on the ground and those that are funding have a little bit more coordination.